Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode <laughs> 12. <laughs> Sorry, Mark was just giving a beautiful face as he always does. It's so pretty. <laughs> you just look so pretty today. Aw, thanks. I don't know what it is. I wish I could say the same. <laughs> oh, well, Nomal, <laughs> um, can you say something nice to me so I feel good? You are... My sunshine, my, my only sunshine. sunshine. You make, make me, me happy, happy when skies are gray. Okay, that's it. You'll never know, dear? No. How much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. Okay! Hey! Jeez. Welcome to episode 12. Uh, today is a small squad, um, but we're still going to have a lot of fun. It's myself, Mark, Skamooch, and Noam. So, gentlemen... Let's have a good time. Let's get weird. Yeah. No, Mel. Hello. Off to you, brother. Hello, boys. How's your week been? Fantastic. Pretty good, man. P- Pinkies right. won the championship last night. Congratulations. Yes, Congratulations. sir. Woo! Congrats. You are all champions of the world. Felt good. We are the was- ASHL C2 division champions Wednesday nights at Etobicoke Canland. Woohoo! We'll okay. see you at facilities in a couple weeks. Of the yeah. world. Of yeah, the world. That was our uh, Pinky's first championship. Been to two semis, a championship, and another championship. And God uh, damn it. <laughs> yeah, we won last night. That was fun. That was a lot of fun. It's a true. So shout out. Uh, yeah, we're. Uh, <laughs> yeah, like Scamp said, we're going to facilities in uh, two and a half weeks. So we play the champions of Monday nights, Tuesday nights, Thursday nights, Friday nights. And if we win that, we go to Chicago, which would be nuts. You know, Chicago. Chicago. So yeah, our week's been, been uh, what, Chicago? Yeah. Mm, no. No. Uh, yes, but like 20 years ago, so I don't remember it. Mm. Have you been? No. I, I would no, no, love no, no, to go. No, no, no. I've only heard good things. I only heard the greatest <laughs> things about Chicago. Only good news has ever come out of Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> Oprah and Michael Jordan, and that's it. And the pizza there, too. Well, let's, uh, let's win facilities to go to Chicago. Yeah. I mean, Chicago... Uh, Let's just leave it at that. Maryland. <laughs> I, it's, this is my transition into my first segment. Ooh. Gentlemen, which is my, my little note back to last week. Missed you last week, bro. And um, to not let you feel left out, okay? We, oh it's not a full segment. Oh, God. But we, this is a new one that I found this week. Okay. And I would love to understand. <laughs> Do you guys know what this little girl is saying? <laughs> How do I get rid of this? Are you a chicken or a fucking chicken? Well, explain to me what it is. I don't know what that is. What are you asking me? A what? Are you a chicken or a fucking chicken? <laughs> what? Or a fucking chicken? I'm a fucking chicken. I guess I'm a jittlyang. No, you do not want to do that. I'm sorry. A fuck latugan? <laughs> she kind of says a little wonky, but um, <laughs> the, the term is, are you a jittlyang or a fata latugan? A fata latugan. F-A-T-A-L-A-T-O-O-G-A-N. Fata latugan. <laughs> so I'm sorry. Is that a thing? This is Baltimore slang. Apparently, oh, I haven't done my thorough research, but this is Baltimore slang. For? Um, well, you choose first. Are you a Jitlingang or a Fatalatugan, my friend? Holy shit. Are you a chill? Okay, she's so talking to her parents in that, right? What is, like, oh, Lord. Um, Can you imagine sending your Can you kid? say the first one again? <laughs> Jitliang. A Jitliang. J-I-T-T-L-E-Y-A-N-G. Are you a Jitliang or a Fatalatugan? Country of origin. Baltimore? Baltimore, Maryland. <laughs> Actually, it might be UK slang as well, so... Because you know how they, like, Baltimore's yeah. like, you, yo, you did so you, Yang, do you know, you know what it is? Like, you know what yeah, it is? Right, yeah, Can you, like, we need some, we need to, yeah, can you, like, like use I, it in, like, um, a sentence? Like, um, a Chitliang or a Fatalatu. Okay, if I can't, I can't, I don't have it on, on my whips about me to do a, a Baltimore accent. Okay, that's but fine. But if that's it's fine. Toronto <laughs> man, it's like, yo, bear, there are bear Jitliangs here, fam. <laughs> like girl, <laughs> girls? No, 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 no. Like rockets? Maybe, maybe. Roaches? Okay, I didn't say it in the in the. That that's more of a positive outlook. Look at it oh. from a negative way. Oh, okay, okay. Jitliang's negative. Fat Latugan is, I guess, a good thing. 
Jitli Yang would be like Wastemans in Toronto? Kind like, of. Kind Ooh, of like, you're, on the, you're on the right track. Jit, okay, so Jit Liang or we're going with is the shittier one. Yeah, he and said the, he the said Fata Latougain is like that's <laughs> it. the Fata Latougain. <laughs> Bro, I don't even want to say the words because I know I'm going to say it so wrong and it's going to sound like I'm Just saying say a like slur. The, girl, the little girl says it. Fata Latougain. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's the bad one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Mom, are you a Jit Liang or a Fata Latougain? No, Jit Liang is the bad one. Yeah. Because she was like. The mom was yeah, like, all right, I guess I'm a Jit Liang. And she's yeah. like, no, you don't want to be a Jit Liang. <laughs> you said waste man. Yeah, you said that was and close. And you said it was kind of on the same, on the right path. Yeah, Fat, Fata Latugan is, um, <laughs> I guess, do you want me to just give it up at this point? I mm, give us like another minute. I want to, f- I, I want to at least be on the right path. It, okay, try to think of it as like you're trying to accomplish something. So one accomplishes something and one doesn't. So if you're a waste man in one thing. But you're just like a homie in the other one, no? Yeah, but like you got to think of like what, like what type of social interactions would you be doing? Like you're like you're super outgoing. Like you talk a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Which would require you to do you're what? You're on the right track. Which would require you to go out a lot. Uh huh. And interact with lots of people. Specifically, woman. Women? Oh, Riz. Well, is it oh, Riz? Oh, it's a Riz. It's Riz. Bing bang boomer. We Ooh. have a winner. <laughs> Two. Okay, so wait. So if you're a, a Fatla Two Gain, <laughs> yeah. you have lots of Riz. Yeah, you, and if you're, you're a a, a, jo, a what? A Jit Liang. A Jit Liang. Can you okay, can you play it again now? Now I want to hear it. The little girl. Just. Uh, are you a Jit Liang or Fatla Two Gain? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. <laughs> are you a Jit Liang or Fatla Two Gain? Well, explain to me what it is. I don't know what that is. What are you asking me? But you, okay, that's not. That sounds like a fucker with two games. Yeah, yeah fucker with two. That's how yeah, I was saying it for like a week, and my yeah. cousin, my little cousins, were like, "That's not how you say it at all." So like, is this like a viral clip? This has gone like a lot of people know about this. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. All right. Well, I think the boys are fucked with two games. <laughs> Mark's still like so cautious. He's like, "Fuck no, I'm not saying that shit." Uh, I'll pass. <laughs> Oh, well, that's that, you know what's crazy about that is now I'm thinking to everything we said last week made so much sense. Yeah, it's like us. all those words. I'm like, that's yeah, man. Like, okay, but that now you hear that shit, it's like Chinese. I know, and I'm yeah. like, that to them probably is just as easy as the stuff we say. Exactly. If you heard on like the bus, like nice your beak on a done no swag, still you'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> why do I understand yeah. this? <laughs> but to most people, they'd be like, what the fuck did yeah. that guy just say? No, that is crazy. <laughs> yeah, but if you heard on the phone, like, yo, fam, Jit Liang, all these Jit Liangs around. Like, <laughs> no, it literally sounds like a different language. Yeah, like I know. I, <laughs> I like that. That uh, was good. Yeah. That was good. Well, to uh, anyone listening in, if you got that, comment, because uh, I'd be very impressed. Can you imagine? I'd Someone's be very impressed. Like, I know what that is. I know <laughs> what a Jit Liang is. <laughs> Maybe we look stupid for not knowing. I don't That's know. what I'm saying. I want to know. Do, do we sound stupid? Do you know what a Jit Liang is? Who knows? Who Let us know. Who knows? Okay, so um, I don't. I don't want to carry on. I don't want to drag on the slang too long. So we'll kind right. of have the slang. If you if you want to talk about new slang, let us also know about that. If you 100%. if you have a region that you want us to research and be like, yo, talk about this slang and try to decipher that, let me know. Um, but I have a new little segment here, and this is called "What's Weirder If You Got Caught Doing." Oh, oh okay? my god! I will present to you two <laughs> oh situations, okay. and you will let me know which one's weirder, my friends, <laughs> and if you. If, you, if it's spur of the moment, you find one yourself, let me know. Okay. Yeah. So the first one, a little uh, diving off the deep end, but if uh, you feel frisky, let me know. <laughs> okay. Would you rather be caught <laughs> catfishing your crush or borderline stalking them? Now, I know you'd rather not do either, but which one would be weirder if you got caught doing? How extreme catfish oh. are we saying? That's like- Maybe like you're across the country. Because the close proximity ones kind of give me the creeps. Yeah. Right? Okay. I, I only, I've, I've only, this spurred me because I saw a catfish commercial. And I was like, I need to somehow. <laughs> so why are there catfish commercials? That's my question. <laughs> I was on, I was, what is the commercial? I was on MTV. I was on MTV. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I That's feel fair. like, uh, I think it's worse to get caught stalking. Because yeah. like, kind of like what you yeah. were saying, like close proximity type of thing. <laughs> 
And like, I'm, isn't stalking like? I'm sure catfishing is like technically illegal too, but I think stalking is like even more fucking illegal. Yeah, I would, I would probably. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I would have to go with stalking. Stalking, like bad. that just feels so f- stalking's brutal. Fucked. Yeah, like you're following them. Yeah, like <laughs> that's horrible. That's horrible. Like I don't know why I immediately thought. What are you asking us, <laughs> <laughs> guys? I, I need a I need <laughs> advice need for situations. <laughs> <laughs> Stalk, yeah. So, okay. Are you, when you're referring to stalking, is it like you're talking in person, legitimate stalking? Not like social media, kind of just like. Like, we're talking like. Because anyone could do that. Yeah. Like, Joe from you, like, watching. Ooh, yeah. that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you know, their yeah. schedule. Yeah. Because yeah. catfish at the end of the day, I think the person would just be like pissed or be like, ah, whatever. But, like, not, no, I'm not saying, I'm not, hold on. I'm not trying to like ease the situation of how, like, because catfish could be really bad too. Yeah. But stalking, like you said, like that's you, when you said Joe from you, like okay, let's play the extremes. Would you rather be caught as the Joe from you, but without the murder aspect, right? Okay. You don't have you don't have a glass box and someone's trapped in there. <laughs> okay, spoiler. Um, or would you rather be on the show on the episode of Catfish? And you're the one like <sighs> you're getting the, caught, it's like yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you're the one man. they're knocking on their door, and then like they have a picture of Gwyneth Paltrow, and then you walk out. <laughs> and you're like, hey. <laughs> Bro, I feel, uh, <laughs> I feel like that's funnier just for the memes. I'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> Bro, oh. some people are so stupid though. Like, I remember seeing one of like a guy, I think it was like on TikTok, that some, uh, someone was catfishing, pretending to be Katy Perry. Oh. And it was like a male, like it was a full male. <laughs> and like he got caught, and they're like showing him the text and stuff, showing proof that the guy was catfishing. And the guy still believed that it was Katy Perry. He's like, no, oh, I don't. He's like, Katy Perry the was person that was getting catfish. He's like, no, I still believe it's Katy Perry texting me. He was like, you well, guys, they, idiot, though. he's like, you yeah. guys are pranking me. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'll wait until this is over, <laughs> and then I'll get back to. Is this just with like Katie. a regular dude? Uh, like clearly he, not. I think no, he no, needs no. to no, be yeah, like, like that. Uh, he needs, but I'm saying he wasn't like yeah, a, like he wasn't off the famous or whatever. No, no, no. Like, why would you think Katy Perry's messaging you? I don't know, man. Some people are delusional and weird. No, yeah, I think I think I think stalking the catfish. I was dying. Because uh, the first thing I thought of was the the Love is Blind clip that went viral about the chick that said she was... Did you hear She looks that? like Megan Fox. No. You oh, yes, 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 yes. The yes. Megan Fox. I was like, sweetheart. <laughs> Bro, like... I, what do you think I can that? see it a little bit. Okay. I know. But I, I don't can... think it's enough to say to someone, I look like Megan Fox. But the thing that kills me, too, is like, the guy was so cheesed. Yeah. And he's fucking ugly, too. Like, he's yeah, like, I know, I know, 100%. He's like, yeah. He's like, yo, fuck, I thought I was going to date fucking Megan Fox. Bro, he looked like a fucking yeah, G.I. Joe toy that was fucking from, like, 1993. Just fucking face mushed up and shit, got the fucking army buzz cut. It was, like, left on the dying. stove, like, half yeah. of his face was left on the stove. Like, oh, it melted! It melted! And then the doors open, it's him. Well, <laughs> The, you're, you are right. There, there definitely was like, okay, she had, I think, blue eyes or whatever. Like the jaw was like yeah. kind of whatever. But I'm like, if told- you say you're Megan Fox, yeah. you're saying you're walking out and you're making the guy's jaw drop. Exactly. Like you are a 10 out of 10. I, yeah. I she told- was not a 10 out of 10. I told my sister because she was watching the show. And then it like it was, uh, they were having a conversation. And I told her to pause. I was like, pause her right there. And then she was like, she had like this like glaring look at like a certain angle. I was like, she kind of looks like Megan Fox yeah. there. Yeah. And then she's like, okay, I see it. But then I was like, the problem with that is, is that growing up, she was like, she was her idolized. age group is probably like right parallel with Megan Fox. Yeah, yeah. So if you're growing up and you kind of look like her, people are going to be like, hey, you kind of look like Megan Fox. Yeah. And she'll run with that like sure. a Usain Bolt yeah. to the finish line. <laughs> well, dude, it's and then, like, yeah. People become like, not famous, but like semi-famous for looking like other oh, celebrities. Oh, for like, sure. bro, that one guy from Toronto, his name's like Brad or something, who looks like Justin Bieber. Yeah, fake Bieber. Yeah, oh, he like yeah, he got like bare followers and shit. I remember. Oh, he gets like, in. I I seen him at Laurier or in Waterloo, and he yeah. just gets into places. He yeah, went like to Waterloo for free. No, no like oh, he, he visits. Him. Like oh, okay, I'm, I'm surprised yeah. you guys haven't seen him, but like he visits schools, and he'll just be like. I'm fake beaver. Yeah, <laughs> and people will be like, yeah, come on in, dude. Yeah, and it's like, oh my god, it's so. Can I go do it about Geo? Yeah, probably. Or just go and say I'm Mark Giordano. Just go walk into Scotia Bank. <laughs> just go well, right in here for you. practice. What if I just suit up one day, just go from the back practice area and just walk in, just no, no, no. Geo like walks in, and I'm like, oh, sorry. <laughs> You're like, it's a I'm mirror, your, man. I'm your it's long lost son. <laughs> Remember that one night in Calgary? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
But uh, yeah, I don't know that that show that show killed me. Uh, what sorry, what I was gonna say too was like <laughs> it changed so much because if you saw his if you saw his reaction midway, it changed the whole show. Because right away, he's like, oh, my God, that's Megan Fox. Why would I go for anyone else? And, that's it. And yeah. I think the most important thing is the show is called Love is Blind. So it's yeah. supposed to be yeah. – it doesn't matter what the person looks like. This yeah. fucking ugly fuck starts getting pissed <laughs> off that this girl doesn't look like fucking Megan Fox. One of, like, you know, the yeah. most attractive woman on earth. I don't know, man. Yeah, but yeah. I think to answer your original question, uh, I think stalking's worse. Yeah, I think, I think yeah, stalking yeah, is yeah. much stalking worse. Is Catfish worse. would suck. I go stalking. Uh, no, thank you. Yeah. No, thank you. Because some people, oh, well, no, because those are, I was only thinking about the good situations where they were actually the people and they're like, oh, they didn't catfish me. They were pretty, actually. <laughs> well, yeah, that's a great situation, but what's the benefit? Well, I guess not being yeah. stalking. And they're always like, why does your fucking webcam not work, you fucking liar? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, anyways, the second one, a um, uh, simple one. Would you, <laughs> actually, not that simple. Um, would you rather be caught picking your nose and eating the booger? <laughs> Or scratching and sniffing your boom boom. <laughs> bear bear oh. boom boom. <laughs> <laughs> or over the pants. <laughs> bear, 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 bear. Okay. No, they were both we're both just equally as bad, man. Oh <laughs> I feel like I okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just picturing. Nah, this. I know mine's easy, I'm bro. Picturing, I'm picturing. I gotta do booger, yeah, man. Yeah, I gotta no, no, do. No, booger. I know, but I'm laughing in my head because I'm trying to visualize myself, like bro. see someone doing this, and what I would internally think if I see someone pick their booger and eat it. Like, oh I think God, God, I, I would school. laugh first. <laughs> yeah. I would laugh, and then I would be like, "Ew." <laughs> if I saw someone doing the later or the latter, bro. I would literally yak. I'd that, be like, that's, that's brutal. <laughs> that, that reminds me. <laughs> bro, I've seen, like, I'm sure you guys have seen the videos, too, of, like, but I remember there's this one specific one where, like, the guy, I forget where they are. They're either, like, in line or, like, at a bar or something, and the guy, like, has his hand around his wife, and he, like, sticks his hand down her ass, oh my moves God. it around a little, and then fucking sniffs, sniffs it. it. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Legit? Sort of gone, dude. I've seen a worse one on Twitter. Yeah. There was like a yeah, Twitter was, there was two homeless people and there was a guy recording from his balcony. And he was like zooming in. And a lady was like literally digging in this guy's butt. And then she goes <laughs> oh. Oh. And then she look, she goes to him and she goes like this and then he goes uh, like he didn't want it. He goes uh. <laughs> And then the video ended and I threw my phone away. And I burnt it and I got a new phone. Oh my ew, gosh. man. Oh ew. my god. Ew, 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 ew. I actually like I, I gagged a little. I hate Twitter. I hate Yo, Twitter is actually You can see the most now. foul stuff on Twitter. Ew. You're just like randomly scrolling your timeline and then you'd see, yeah. you know. And then my day's ruined. Yeah. Oh, I'm still dying at the booger thing though. What the crazy thing is, is there are some people <laughs> that genuinely do it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, like roll, uh, yeah. munch. Jeez, roll Or even too. forget about, yeah, a little roll, buddy. A little, little <laughs> violin roll. Um, or not even if you don't even eat. You, oh. you, it's normal to pick it and flick. Pick and flick. Pick and flick. Yeah. Pick and flick. No, you're, you're weird if you're just doing that normally. I mean. I can't. I could never. I'm too self con Well, I mean, first of all, I, I don't want to. But, like, in public, like, I would never just, like, walk around just, like, digging. <laughs> Let alone do the other part. Yeah, I was going to say, would you rather <laughs> scratch your asshole and sniff it? But, I mean, this is you Ooh, getting man, caught. Like, so, like, maybe you're, like, hiding and doing it. I don't know. Yeah, it's like I'd still it's, rather get caught picking my nose. <laughs> like it's worse enough to just scratch your ass in public. Like that's already <laughs> bad enough. Like I'd I'd be like, dude, what are you doing? Then to dig and sniff. I mean, yeah. Like what? Wh I agree. Let me add, like, what? What is the purpose behind sniffing? What you think it's gonna smell like flowers? I don't know. Maybe, maybe you're you'd... curious. Yeah. Curious about what? It's always gonna smell like shit. There's never gonna be a time. Did it's I, gonna did smell I wipe good. my ass enough today or what? Maybe you're you're tr keeping track of your diet. I don't know. <laughs> Keep track of your diet. Well, ask Dean because Dean shits like ten times a day. So. <laughs> Dean's probably a sniffer. Orange? What is this orange? <laughs> okay. Um, this one's a little okay. This one's kind of uh, odd. Tell, let us know if you do this because this is this is one that I've seen around. But would you rather be caught pretending like there's a camera crew while filming you during a crazy situation, and you then look to that camera that's not there? Like in the office, you know, like Jim, yep. they'll yeah. be like, like so one get of those. caught doing that, yeah, okay. and then being called up, be like, what the fuck are you doing right now? <laughs> or, um, you're acting out a dramatic scene with dolls and action figures. 
you're like in a room and then you have like you have them set up and you're like duh, 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 duh. and you get I caught. Mean, I, yeah, I, and someone walks in and they go, "Hey man, oh. whoa!" I mean, I already kind of do that one <laughs> <laughs> with all the Star Wars figures and stuff. <laughs> Your mom or Alyssa just walks in. Like he flips like, an action figure on like a higher. He's like, I have the high ground now. <laughs> All right, well now you're just exposing me. <laughs> now I'm just picturing both Mark. of those things sound fucking normal to me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like that's fucking hilarious. Like two people fighting, I- I'd fucking turn to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about you guys. Those are both fucking normal <laughs> to me, dude. Stop fighting and be like. You schizoph- What's going on? <laughs> what are you looking at them talking to? <laughs> you hallucinating? I'm picturing Scam just like sitting in his bed playing with like action figures. He's doing like both of them. In, it's like a Saturday morning, <laughs> Sunday morning. He's just like, ah. His Bro, mom comes in to just like are, ask. He's like, Mark. <laughs> Opens the door. He's like, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> My mom got it. It's like, when, <laughs> it's like when you're younger and make like them kiss. And it's like. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, holy shit, like, if I get caught, this is fucked. <laughs> Can you imagine what he does? Mark, what are you doing? Like, I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean? Who's dolls? Uh-huh. Are you used to, like, take the clothes off, like, you're, you're, I don't, like you don't have Barbies. a sister. Do you have a sister? No, take the clothes off, like, the Barbies and be like, Damn. Whoa. <laughs> I saw my there, first man? pair, mom. <laughs> Does no one have nipples around here? <laughs> What's going on? Uh, I I would choose. Well, considering Mark probably has no say because he I don't give a both, fuck, man. He does them both normally. Do them both. Uh, I would say the action figure one. Um, yeah, I would say the action figure one. I wasn't a big action figure kid. Fucking loser. But <laughs> I'm the loser. You're yeah. the one that's doing this normally. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Anyways, I would, uh, <laughs> anywho, anywho, uh, I I would choose the action figure one. But if you have any action figures, you'd lend me so that I can play too. Uh, well, we'll I would have like five minutes ago. Mm. Not, anymore. not anymore. I'm sorry, Scam. Yo, pertaining to that, just a quick tidbit. Did you know that on YouTube <laughs> there's someone who recreated Toy Story with, with action figures? <laughs> with all really? the toys, like legitimately made the movie. Yeah, the first movie they recreated it. How many views did they get? It's like 50 million. All right, I'm doing it for Star Wars. <laughs> yeah. That's my new thing. Holy, Came out like really? 12 years ago, I think. So I'm like, let me, let me find it. Well, I did, bro, uh, imagine how long it takes to do that. Like, oh, I had, my, I'd actually be curious to know how long it took. I used to, actually, I did that one time. I did, did that with, uh, remember Eric from elementary school? <laughs> we like took a stop Lego. motion thing? Yeah, we did a stop motion thing with Lego yeah. on like the old like VHS camera things and we uploaded it to youtube i don't know if oh, it's yeah. still there i don't know what channel it was on i used to love watching videos of that when i was a kid like they were I remember viral. people used to do like the soccer one like remember there was like a yeah, lego yeah. soccer set i remember yep. people used to do that i'm not gonna play the audio just in case but. oh it's like super homemade yeah they have it like stringed up <laughs> oh so it's not i thought he did it like stop motion he did a full-on like yeah, yeah i think he just ran, ran the audio shit. and just did a shot that, for shot. that has 50 million views mm-hmm. is it the full movie you said mm-hmm so how long is it on that? that an video? hour and 19 minutes. An hour and 20. It's an hour and 19.59. Oh, man. People have too much time. I mean, I, that's his hobby, I guess. But, like, I'm not going to sit there and puppeteer. Sounds like you. a normal Tuesday to me. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's just so, I'd love to just be a fly on the wall in Mark's house. <laughs> just see him doing all the stuff. What are you guys doing later? Uh, fucking play with my toy. What? <laughs> <laughs> play with Woody. <laughs> play with Woody. Yeah, make everyone, it a movie. Yeah, everyone make takes, a the, movie. takes it as an innuendo. <laughs> All right, Marius. Yeah. Playing with Woody, <laughs> eh? <laughs> <laughs> Little buzz action. <laughs> you freak. Marius like, what? <laughs> Anyways. Oh, no. Okay, so my next is, uh, would you, what's weirder? Uh, not, okay, so I, initially I said talking to dogs, but it's kind of more weird if you don't. So not talking to dogs and babies, like, with that voice, you know, like, the okay, yeah. or, uh, do you know what code switching is, by the way, preface this question, code Negative. switching is like, um, it's like when you're in a situation, and then you then adapt to that, like, way of speech, so if, like, okay. you're like surrounded by Toronto and okay. then all of a sudden, oh, you're oh, like, yo, fam, okay, so, would you rather be caught 
talking to babies and dogs normally. Like just like a straight up voice, like yeah. how we're talking right now. Okay. Or be caught code switching. <laughs> those are both like. Jeez, I feel those like, are both so weird. I feel like if I got called out in like a group of people for being like, yo, why are you talking like that? Yeah, I, I, I feel that. like I'd be like so fucking embarrassed. <laughs> like, bro, it's all, I don't know if you guys have been seeing like those TikTok where it's like, um, it's like interviews of like high schoolers in Saga and like they like interview them at square one and stuff. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. yo fam, like, yo, St. Marcelinus oh, is the yeah, worst yeah. fucking school in fucking PL fam. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. yo, uh, uh, fucking, yo, those teachers fams are fucking wild in fam. And it's like, the people in the comments are just fucking laughing so hard. And <laughs> no it's one like, talks like that. It's so cringe. Yeah, so I, I think I like, agree. if I like got called out for that, like I'd definitely just be like, fuck, I'm a loser. <laughs> I know. My favorite's of the, the one of the guy. He's like, yo, people who aren't from Toronto that speak like this are freaking way suits. Yeah. And the guy goes, so where are you from? He goes, Saga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, like, yeah, I, was I, was say, I did like, see that one. I did see that like one. It's like in square one. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Like, Jesus, man. What are, you, what are we doing? See, but <laughs> I'm also just thinking of how weird it is to like, what if you're just talking to a baby, yeah. like, how's it going, sir? <laughs> yeah. You want some fucking baby food, bitch? <laughs> yeah. Baby's hungry. Are you hungry? <laughs> no? Okay, your baby, it's not. It's fine. It's fine. fine. He's good. No, no, he's, he told me. We spoke. Yeah. But the and thing is, I feel like there are actually people that do that. Like, they are, and that's yeah. how the yeah. weirdos are born into this world. Maybe but they think we're fucking weird. <laughs> but what if, like, I think the, the, uh, the more difficult one is a dog. Like, if you see a dog, yeah. you're like, hey, little guy, how's it going? Yeah, just like, hey. Yeah, yeah. they're like, hey, how are you? Good animal. Good. And the weather is crazy, right? Anyways. <laughs> if yeah, that, I, if I, I saw that, I'd run. Whatever room I'm in, I'd run yeah, out of that. I would room. just think you're, like, oh, crazy. Sure. Yeah. Like, there's Dahmer Jr. But uh, I would also... Uh, Dahmer Jr. <laughs> Dahmer Jr. <laughs> I mean... Uh, I choose... Yeah, I, I, I think it would be worse to... Uh, I think it would be worse to be caught out for code switching. Yeah. I could never. And I'm for only sure. thinking Toronto man's... Um, yeah, I'm only thinking the Toronto man's accent, but there's so many other different types of accents or whatnot that I would hate to be called out for. It's just not how I talk. Yeah. It's just sure. not how I would talk. Exactly. Okay. Would you, you want to go on to the next one? Uh, sure. This one is not that great, but would you rather clog a toilet and flood the bathroom oh my or gosh. shit your pants? <laughs> is that actually a... I think it's a pretty easy answer. I'm clogging the toilet, man. You... Which but one it's would flooding. you run? And you're getting caught. Like, it's not just clogged, like, it's all over the floor, flooding. Oh. Oh. Nah, I'm, I'm shitting my pants. Dude. <laughs> you're getting caught shitting. Where your are pants. you? Where, oh, where is this happening? I, forget, I keep forgetting we're getting caught. Who's doing catching these things. You're uh, at someone's house. Uh, yeah, give us, yeah, give us a scenario for each one. Okay. Oh. You're, at a, uh, you're at a girlfriend's house, yeah. right? Like, for you, it would be horrible. You yeah, clogged yeah. your girlfriend's bathroom. Or you're at um, a nightclub. Oh, my God. Oh, my dude. God. <laughs> They're both fucking terrible. You're just talking to a girl? Because it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's one thing clogging the toilet. It's another number. thing that the toilet's fucking overflowing and shit. At That's what you said, right? Place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think fucking anywhere, dude. Even my own house. I'd have to fucking leave. <laughs> I would just leave myself. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I think there's water fucking everywhere. Where's Mark? <laughs> I just like go take the dog for a walk. <laughs> <laughs> just completely dip. <laughs> you whisper it as you're like leaving the door. You're like, I'm gonna take the dog for a walk. <laughs> uh, man. I don't think I can choose, bro. <laughs> I think they're, this is one that's equally like, <laughs> they're both brutal. <laughs> I think the next one I have is also fucking horrible. And it's, it's in the same taste as well. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know. I, I actually I don't know. I can't decide. This is like a life fucking crisis. I dude. can't decide. So it's like coin flip, either one. Yeah, I got to do a coin flip on that one, I think. <laughs> okay, here's the next one. Accidentally poo in the pool in front of friends. <laughs> Or throw up on Thanksgiving dinner <laughs> right on the table in front of the whole family <laughs> due to bad tasting food. You were like, who made these green beans? And then like you ate them and then you're like, ah, nah. <laughs> uh, bro, that's <laughs> see if you didn't toss in 
the oh uh, who made these like because then then i feel bad for the person that cooked exactly. them that's the point if i just yuked on the table that's a different story uh, i don't mean to get technical with it but i feel like if i was in the thanksgiving situation i would just be like say like who made this whatever and then throw up finish with it and i just be like yo sorry like i have like a phobia of this food like i, acc- <laughs> I accidentally ate it and like just fucking yacked that's good thinking <laughs> I'm not. Whereas if you shit yourself in the pool, it's like. <laughs> <laughs> it's game over. Everyone's out of the pool. Sorry, boys. <laughs> pool time's over, brothers. <laughs> and then the poo's probably going to like dissolve and shit. Like, it'll just float to the They're top. probably going to have to fucking take all the water out. <laughs> like, uh, I think I'm. At I least think, Thanksgiving, it's like, all right, guys, let's just go get McDonald's. I think I have an answer. <laughs> I think I have an answer here, and I think it's I think it's Thanksgiving for this one. Yeah, I can't I, so I can't too. get around to the like. Imagine the pool parties we'd have. Yeah, like, like if someone just shit in my pool, I'd be like, Yo, fuck you, bro. Who pooed? Who pooed? <laughs> just thinking of that, like, imagine coming around to saying that. It's just you see it floating. You're just like, Yo, who the fuck shit right now <laughs> in my pool? What? Nah, yeah, that would nah, be Thanksgiving. No, nah, yeah. I'm yakking on Thanksgiving Me too. Dinner. Imagine sure. being in the pool. That's <laughs> when you're like, <laughs> you have your goggles on. <laughs> <laughs> Something hits you in the forehead. Just, <laughs> just like, what was that? <laughs> it's like being chased by a fucking shark. <laughs> <in> <laughs> a way, yeah. I know. I didn't agree to be in this soup. Get, get me out of here. <laughs> Ew, okay, no, I'm actually gonna my stomach. No, please, <laughs> not the soup. Okay. I swear I've seen a video of someone shitting in a hot tub before, <laughs> and the water just like actually turns brown. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst. The hot tub's worse because it's more compact. Yeah. <laughs> like the bubbles are fucking buzzing. This guy's gonna it's yak. Hot. He's gonna yak. <laughs> Yo, that's I can't. Do you I can't. need gum or water? I, or something? I just no. Please move on. Okay, for my I, own sanity. I have a few funny stories here because I think I ended it myself with the poo. I was like, this is. I got too close to Dean. I like it. <sighs> He's Anyways. off on us. So I uh, I was googling uh, funny things and weird weird stories. <laughs> And then uh, I found these little quotes that this like I actually found funny. So listen in and, and give us your take yep. as to what you hear afterwards. Um, I was drunk at an escape room with coworkers. It was an extreme one where you are handcuffed the entire time. I decided in my drunken state that it would be a badass idea to dislocate my thumb and slip the cuffs off <laughs> like in the movies. It wasn't. We got kicked out and my coworkers were weirded out. And then I had to go to the hospital. And then I quit a few weeks later. White collar jobs are not for me. <laughs> <laughs> so Buddy decided to just, how would you even? I don't know, man. I don't, how does that come across your mind when you're in an escape room to not only like go past the idea of breaking them, but to hurt yourself to do it. And then you're like, Psst. that's kind of impressive. To be honest, I'm actually genuinely thinking of what he would have done. Yeah, but think about like your reaction if someone did that. Oh, like, I, you're psycho. Yeah, you'd be like, you're escape the room, fuck dude. Are just you like doing, go knock on the door, big. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. See you later. That, guy, that guy's crush was definitely in the room. He's like, yo, yo, this is gonna win her over, bro. <laughs> the amount of ex- like ideas that go through your head when you're around people that kind of make it giddy or crazy, it should you should be confined and constrained. In a fucking room. That that's to the extreme. I mean, he was. That's to the extreme. You're right. I'm like, if that that's probably what the situation was. Or he's just a psycho and like he really wanted to like get it done and just didn't know the proper codes or whatnot. But yeah, you go to extremes, man. But that is like no. that shouldn't go that should not run through your head. But mark it on the nose. Like, okay, I have handcuffs on. Uh yeah, I can't dislocate your thumb. I mean like there's but a million it's like other th- in the movies, you know, like you, those weird thoughts go through your mind when like you're trying to impress somebody. Yeah. And it's just a stupid shot in the dark that <laughs> just usually ends up in someone's eye. I'm actually starting to just think about all the stupid things and like, <clears throat> like what's yeah, the dumbest yeah. thing you've done in front of like trying to impress someone? Can't think of anything. Not off the top you know of what my I, head. Definitely you know what I? You know what I? You know what I? I don't know why I I just remembered this, you shaved your but head. it wasn't. <laughs> you know what? We went a couple episodes without it. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> but it's okay. No, no, it's fitting. It's quite fitting. I, I wasn't, it wasn't trying to impress someone, but the most embarrassed I think I've been was, uh, remember Jordan's backyard? Yeah. So she had a hot tub there. This was in like elementary school. And I remember we got invited over one time to go in the hot tub. Th- this honestly may have been like one of my, and you, you probably don't even remember. It's not like a huge embarrassing thing, but everyone was sitting in the hot tub and I was like a chubby kid. 
So I didn't get in properly. And I remember just when I got in, I slipped and I just like zoop, like <laughs> right in under. And I came up like, Whoa. like, and I trying to be, I was trying to be like subtle, no. subtle about yeah. it. Like, you know, take like a step, whatever, walk in. And there was like Rebecca, some of the other girls, whatever. Yeah. And it was like, like, it's a hot tub. Like we were all just kids. There's like, I don't know, six or seven of us. But I remember thinking like, yo, the way you get into a hot tub, I'm not trying to impress, but like, yo, you know, going casually. Yeah. Okay. Hop one foot in when it first step, just soup. God, you chubby ass. And I remember I like kicking, kind of, I, I kind I remember, of remember like kicking everyone. <laughs> I went in and I just, oh my, my feet went everywhere. That's Can you like, get those are the like, kind of things. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Crazy entrance, right guys? <laughs> Fucking. And you try to play it cool and everyone's like, dude, what, are you okay? Is your head all right? Yeah. I it, actually like kind of remember Yeah, that, that, was, that was really bad oh, man. for me. I can't yeah. think of any off the top of my head. Like, Bro, I, I, I think I don't. I nearly pulled my hamstring, like, trying to, like, play outdoor football. Just being like, I'm so sick. I tried to hurdle, like, a group of... <laughs> hurdle? Yeah, because there was, like, a group of kids playing, right? And then I, I tried, and then my hamstring kind of gave up, and then I just fell. Are the kids okay? No, they were, they were completely fine. None of the lawsuits hit. We all settled. <laughs> what the fuck? No, no. I, I, I cleared, like... The, you know how, like, if, if it's a circle, like, just the skinnier side of the circle, you're not yeah. going the full diameter. Yeah. It's, like, just... No, that is... Especially forward. sports, too. That was, like, guys yeah. that all yeah, play yeah, sports 100%. growing up. Like, I remember um, when I was playing on the Terriers. This was, like, grade seven. We used to practice Friday nights. I don't think it was every Friday, but Friday nights right at Meadowville, right before Fun Skate. Oh, Like, yeah. we were on the ice right before Fun Skate. So, like, when, like, there was, like, 10 minutes left in practice, it'd be, like, so many people sitting in the stands just, like, tying their skates and stuff. So, like, at the end of practice, like, you know, you're trying, like, super <laughs> hard. Like, you're doing, like, fucking tricks you can't even do. Like, just That's stupid jokes. shit like I that. I forgot about like, that. I forgot you, yeah. That, that, that would hype me up. I think there's a lot of things about that. If someone's, like, watching in the stands, you just do some. Oh, yeah. The funnier aspect to that is you think they're watching. And they're, they're not. They're not. not. <laughs> no, no, they're probably like, yo, this guy's fucking ass. If they, like, look for, like, one second, they're like, yo, this guy's actually shit. Well, <laughs> the first experience I ever had about that was FNL. <laughs> we play Actually, yeah, I can imagine what you guys felt like at FNL. Oh, like, like you guys must have been like, people, holy shit, we're like, oh like, my god, everyone's like dialed in watching. Every yeah. time we went after the game, yo, we won, we won. They're like, oh, you won? Oh, sick. I'm like, <laughs> do you not watch? Yeah. And they're like, no, we were oh, talking the whole time. Give a shit. I'm like, whoa. Bro, honestly, too, like, because all of us, like, as someone who went to go, like, yeah. none of the students would really sit in the stands. We'd all just kind of be on, like, the track yeah. standing. Yeah. So, like, it's actually hard to see from oh, there. Oh, for sure. Like, you yeah, can't yeah, see yeah. shit. No, no. You only see one side. If we but had, like, proper high school, like, Texas high school bleachers, I think yeah. people then would watch. But yeah. Oh, don't but, get me. Yeah, don't get me thinking too much about the embarrassing things. There's there's too many. Now my mind's yeah. racing. You want to hear a, another embarrassing? Oh, God. Little, this one. This one's pretty fucking funny. So, this one says... During lockdown, I was invited to a fight club in an abandoned farm. I drove down and up, ended up fighting two people at various levels and styles. The last fight, we all just collectively decided to fight naked because that's what the ancient Greeks did. We said, fuck it. We ended up fighting two three-minute rounds before shaking hands and going our own way. Boxes were ticked. Never felt the urge to do it again. Stupid thing, though. Hey, do you want to meet two strangers and fight naked in a in farmhouse? Eh, no. So <laughs> this is legit. <laughs> yeah, this is I legit. searched up like, like weird, <laughs> crazy situations that people have been in. I don't and even then, know how to react to that. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Fight club in itself is crazy. Yeah. But then for someone to go, yo, you want to take off all your fucking clothes? <laughs> I feel like doing it too. I was like, yo, no. don't let Dana White watch. This, <laughs> He's gonna get some ideas. Boil me up. <laughs> All right, guys. UFC 300. <laughs> Butt naked. Butt naked. Just Bruce Buffer. Yeah. Morning yeah. in the Time! Five rounds for the undisputed cock championship yeah. of the world. <laughs> You're just like, what the fuck? Uh, uh, I love sword fights. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I hated it. hearing that at parties. <laughs> Yo, anyone try to sword fight? <laughs> no, use the bathroom on your own. Let me know when you're done. <laughs> and that, I'm just thinking, like, back to the story. Imagine, like, <laughs> you're, like, there watching, and then someone just, like, pushes you in. All right, you're next. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. Oh man, that'll be fucking brutal. Like you get pushed in the middle, you turn around, you're like, I just came to watch. I just came. <laughs> Next thing you know, you're fucking naked in the ring. You're like, you're naked and afraid. It. Yeah. It's <laughs> camera right behind oh. you. But you, do, you do the look, you're like, I didn't, I didn't plan for any of this. <laughs> but I guess. <laughs> naked and afraid. Oh my God. Dude. <laughs> oh, that never. would be the worst thing ever. Yeah. Like, you get, you imagine being <laughs> dragged like, there. Literal worst nightmare. Yeah, bro. If you go yeah. to this fight club, where? At the abandoned farm by Clarkson and, and, and DeVille. <laughs> and you're like, no. Want to go check it out? It's Friday night. Fuck it. <laughs> sure. Bro. You uh, walk in, just everyone's naked, <laughs> slapping meat. What's <laughs> that noise? They're fucking fighting in there, boys. Barn's hot. You next. Sign up. Oh, uh, no. Fuck that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Those are situations I hope I never fucking find myself in. <laughs> you find yourself there, fucking run. <laughs> run until you see the sun. All right, no. End it, end it, with, end it with one last. One last um, one. One I, last question, one last riddle, one last something. Okay. Um, let, me, <laughs> let me find something I, I was trying to... Because that was the end of it. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Um, I will give you uh, a few of these. You, you, you get the option. This is a riddle. Uh, not really a riddle. It's more of a question of a fact. What do, and I don't know the answers to these, so your guess is as good as mine. Oh, God. Um, what do you think there's more of? Headstones or pillows in the world? What is a headstone? When you're dead. Like a... Oh. Yep. Or pillows? Or pillows. I think I'm saying I'm pillows. Going pillows. I think I'm going pillows. I think I go pillows. Because I feel like for headstones, you only have like one per, per person, person, but pillows, like you. Could like I four. sleep with like fucking four pillows. Yeah. True. And there's sometimes doubled up people per headstone. Yeah. But there have been more people dead than there are currently alive. You gotta take that into But I feel like the people that have died, not everyone has a headstone. You know Let us know I mean? what you think in the comments. Because <laughs> I think when. This this might be such a stupid question, but I swear when like graveyards get like full, don't they like remove like the super old ones? I, that I actually, I think you might be right. So like um, some people get that relocated. How that works? Yeah, yeah. Like if you were buried in like eighteen hundred, like oh, maybe, and someone just died and they need space, like do they take you out? I actually don't know. I, <laughs> I actually, <laughs> that's a good question. So very good job, right me. Right yeah, good job. <laughs> um, doors or wheels? The classic one. Are there more doors yeah. or wheels? I used to. Th- Wait, what did I used to think it was? I used to think it was doors, but now I think, I think it's, it's wheels. wheels I man. think I'm like fully It's convinced. like one door per roll, oh, but any wheel? And any door. Door. Door, door, door. Mm. Actually, no, those aren't stalls. Door, door. I, I think it's still I wheels. Know. I think I think yeah? it's wheels. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I guess. I, I guess think. wheels would make more sense. Like car like wheels, I'm just looking like at shit anything wheels. There's four wheels right there. Yeah, there's, there's two doors. Right there. There's wheels on that little suitcase thing right there. Yeah, I, I go think wheels. it's wheels. I go wheels and pillows. Okay. I'm going wheels and pillows. That's Same. Thing. Last one. Wood or metal? Is there more wood or metal? Oh, I've seen this one too. I actually, this one's hard. Like wood. But are you, t- what do you mean by, it? I'm trying to think like, yeah, okay. There's like, this is all wood. The thing in here is wood. Like is this considered metal? Mm-hmm. That's, a, that, that's what I mean. I that is, no I actually clue. don't know. But then I'm just thinking, well, yeah, man, I don't know. Because then I go forest, but then I go all the cars in the world. Yeah, and like cities. And then cities. Like, <sighs> I, I, that one, I don't know. Now I'm starting, at first, when you first you said metal. it, I was like, wood, wood. But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, with all the might condo buildings. Metal. Like, I go, oh. Because think about how big some of those buildings are, too. Like, literally, like, skyscrapers, for example. Like, Yeah. I know, but I'm just thinking about, like, how much of the world is just yeah forest. But the thing trees. is, every fucking day, it's, like, there's more shit being torn down. That's true. And, like, and there's iron built up. and, like, natural metals. I don't I know, think man. I, you stumped us on the last one, brother. That one is fucked. You stumped us on the last one, sir. What do you think? I don't know. I I wrote them down. I fucking <laughs> <laughs> I think probably wood. 
Wood? Yeah. Okay. No, it's fucking stupid. Because... I, I don't know, man. Like, I... I, yeah, I, know. I need to know what a metal is because there's probably scientists out there who are like, well, that's not metal. The amount of metal in the sea. Then, oh, no, no. I'm that's what I was actually thinking, thing. too. I feel like there's like shit in the sea. Yeah. I, I think I'm going metal. I think yeah. I'm going metal. metal Choose metal. Metal. Be the right metal, 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 metal. Well, metal. that's a wrap. That's a wrap. That was good. That was good. My mind was actually, I, I actually had to think about a lot of questions on this one. Right I don't from the think beginning. a lot, so it was nice. No, definitely don't think a lot. We don't think a lot. But what we learned from last episode is we should start thinking before we speak. Ish. That is that is <laughs> that is definitely what we did learn. <laughs> but we'll see next week if uh, you know what faces we have because you know we know a couple of friends that do not do that. That do not do that. Not you, silly Willie. Uh-huh. Not you, silly <laughs> Willie. <laughs> cutie patootie. <laughs> Freak. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up because Mark uh, Mark has to go play with his toys. Um, it's yeah, it's eleven o'clock, right? You play with toys at eleven. Yeah, before yeah, you yeah. sleep, always, always. For sure. Well, thank you all for tuning in. Um, if there were any would you rather's or situationals or the last couple that still stumped me, I'll probably Google a few. Um, let us know in the comments below what your thoughts were. Um, as always, if you enjoyed the episode, please like, subscribe, uh, leave a rating on uh, Spotify or Apple Music. Um, mm-hmm. But thank you for tuning in. And uh, until next week, uh, stay weird, people. Stay weird. Cheers. Bye.